Welcome to this video. Most fundamentals in science indicate and prove that the origin of all humans are the Amerans and the Americas. Further there is a significant amount of important genetic differences between Amerans and the rest of the world. Several of these mostly genetic differences are listed further in this video. These profound and essential differences are ever more recognized by scientists, but not recognized or verified by consensus. That could mean that most of the people that live today will never know who their ancestors were and are, where they come from, or understand the importance of this. Further the differences between Amazon Amerans and all other humans are so profound, essential, and systematic that they cannot be explained by evolution, drift or any standstill in Beringia or anywhere else, except the Americas as a whole. Further there must have been a tremendous time of isolation of the Americas and the Amerans from their descendants all over the world. Further there is a reason for this one directional isolation other than distance and it certainly is not because the Americas were not populated, because they were indeed significantly populated and this by Amerans, and has said exactly that Amerant population is proven to be the ancestor of all humans. The reasons for such one directional isolation are explained in other videos and ebooks of mine. Such a directional isolation of the Americas is something totally different than that there were no Amerans at all until the Holocene, as was and still is supposed by consensus, this while consensus negates the fundamentals in science that tell totally otherwise. Fundamentals in science indicate that Amerans are very old and much older than for instance mitochondrial Eve and the mitochondrial haplogroup L, which are estimated by consensus to exist only since around 200,000 years ago and as such quite young in the context of human evolution. Consensus should consult the fundamentals and fund scientists to do what they should do, and that is researching and concluding based solely on fundamentals and science rather than on what consensus suggested since very long. Regardless of this all fundamentals already in place and researched indicate that the origin of all humans are the Amerans and the Americas. Again, all the results of the fundamentals and consequently the fundamentals themselves are systematically negated by consensus, this at least for decades. That more or less means that scientists are not sufficiently funded to research the fundamentals that already indicate for many years that the Amerans and the Americas are the origin of all humans. This of course prejudices science and humanity. As said, this way we possibly will never know where we descend from, this while independent reports, indications and conclusions of science already in place are very clear all humans come from or more correctly descend from Amerans and the Americas. We also are at risk that we will never know our full history and what it could teach us. 1. About solving our problems. 2. About staying healthy and thrive. 3. About taking care of our planet the best way. All this is extensively presented in other videos of my main channel, JM. There are separate and additional channels of mine, JM, with speech and titles in the next languages. English, Portuguese, Dutch, Spanish and French. Once accepting the fundamentals and the fact that Amerans exist for a very long time, all paradigms solve, and it would become feasible or even easy for the general public to understand who they are and who their ancestors are, and even how their ancestors became their ancestors and turned over the world and became the modern humans as we know them today. Further, probably only after accepting the fundamentals. The DNA tests, that so many people invest in, will be able to give the correct answers. All paradigms related to consensus hypotheses will be solved. A significant number of fossils of amaranths of over hundreds of thousands of years and possibly much more were found also in the Americas, however these fossils were systematically negated by consensus, supposedly because these American fossils should be too modern. This negation of American fossils by consensus is not at all based on fundamentals. Fundamentals prove that the Amerans of over hundreds of thousand of years had to be modern or early modern, simply because they were the direct ancestors of all modern humans, this while the time frame to evolve from anywhere else is much too short to be possible. Today science and consensus no longer claim we descend from primates, but rather from a non-specified common ancestor of humans and primates. At the same time modern specialized science proves that 6 million years is too short for humans to evolve from primates to modern humans. 1. That makes it clear that any time less than 6 million years is too short to evolve from the ancestors to humans. 2. That also makes it clear that any time less than 6 million years is too short to evolve from the ancestors to primates. This unless the common ancestor of is a modern human. And that is exactly what the fundamentals tell us all the time. Our ancestor is human and is the Amazon Amaranth, and the Amazon Amaranth lives and exists for millions of years in the Amazon forest where they thrived. Thank you for watching.